We are having a wonderful time here at the 2009 Discover a New You Retreat. And I have to say, shame on you if you didn't come because you're missing out. <laughs> We've got Christy Middleton with us today. How are you doing, Christy? I'm doing great, thank you. Okay, and you're with us. Tell us what brought you to the Discover a New You Retreat. God brought me to the Discover You New Retreat. Um, I'm here to share information about health education for women and, and hopefully people will be able to take some information home and be able to sustain life and just have a healthy life. Okay, and you know it is so important when we talk about health, I, I don't think that we realize just how much, I don't know if it's all the stuff that's in the environment or while we're getting the things that we get, you know, but talk to us about the importance of the overall health of a woman. Um, it's important for a woman to know um, just how her body functions, how her hormones function, um, foods that can actually impact um, how her body heals, how her body works for her, how um, she can alleviate pain just by nutrition, by exercising, by taking certain herbal medications. Um, it's good to have someone who can explain um, things that the doctor doesn't have time to explain in a 15 minute appointment. Um, so, you know, a lot of women don't talk about ailments, uh, just natural ailments that we deal with every month, um, every day. Um, there's a lot of women, even since the beginning of time, even in the Bible it's noted about women who have issues with blood, um, women who have fibroids, uh, endometriosis. Um, there's women who are going through hot flashes, you know, and we keep it personal. We don't share with other sisters, you know, and when we do, um, it's very taboo, very quiet. Um, I don't know how many times you've been in a predicament where you've asked another sister, um, am I okay? You know, you walk by and you're like, you know, I'm flowing a little heavy today, am I okay? And the other sister knows where you're coming from, you know? <laughs> so these are the things that we're gonna talk about, like what is abnormal? Um, just the signs and symptoms of uh, different ailments. We're going to learn about breast cancer and self-care. What is that? Why do my breasts hurt? You know, why am I bleeding so much? How can I help this menopause? It's killing me. What is menopause? You know, why is my cycle too long? So that's what we're doing this weekend. Oh. My goodness, they're probably going to be following you through the hallways. You know? <laughs> I'm talking, oh, Christy, I got this right here. You know, seriously, because while you said a mouthful, women, we, we don't tell things. You know, we could be hurting and we won't go to the doctor. We talk about men all the time that they won't, but we're just as bad as they are. You know, why do you think we do that? I think that... Um, women have to take a lot on their shoulders. We have to juggle many different um, uh, roles. We have to be a wife. We have to be a cousin. We have to be a sister. We have to be a mother. We have to be a best friend. And there's really no time for us to deal with our health issues. Um, and you just said it, like we, we may have husbands or boyfriends or significant others or children with the flu or with diabetes and we're taking care of them. We're cooking their food. We're trying to keep their temperatures down. And there's no time to take care of ourselves. And when we do, um, it's TMI. It's too much information. People really Really don't want to hear it so this is a perfect opportunity to actually sit down and discuss it and just learn a little bit of you know um, a little bit of ways to actually like heal ourselves yeah. And you know, and I, I always harp on this though, but everyone that we've been talking to, y'all, your hearts, I could feel the passion coming out of you for what it is that you're saying. You know, it's not you just here just to be, I'm trying to make a dollar off somebody or, or anything like that. It's a true passion. And so would you say this is what got you into the field that you're in? It actually did. Um, it's funny, you know, I, I wanted to be a nurse. It's probably since I was nine, I was in church and my godmother asked me, what do you want to do? And I kept it in my heart that I'm going to be a nurse. And I went to college and my GPA wasn't high enough to enter into the nursing program. So I ended up with a health education degree and I learned about teaching people um, how to prevent illness, you know, helping people in that way. And that nurse passion, you know, even though I went out and I taught health education, that passion was still there. And I decided, you know, actually I discovered that 
all of the positions that I was interested in, actually doing what I'm doing now, were available to nurses. That credibility was there. So I went back to nursing school for that, and it has been a blessing. I do it in my full-time life. I teach uh, women every day about um, how to take care of themselves during pregnancy and find them resources. And it, it's a blessing to, to make that into a business. Well, I thank you for being with us, you know, because um, we've had um, other nurses before that came. We talked about nutrition, but I just feel like you're going to put another little edge on it. I, I feel it. Yeah. <laughs> it's, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, I know we're about to get out of here, you know, but is there something that we didn't touch on that you'd like to say for those who are watching right now? Um, just check out the website, um, www.ladyvitala.com. I would love to come to your area and uh, teach you classes, teach your friends, your sisters, your aunts, you know, your mom um, about information. And if you need any resources, if you're on bed rest or you have cancer and you need someone to assist you, I'll be happy to find that for you too. So give me, you know, check out the site, www.ladyvitala.com. Okay, thank you, Christy. Okay, and ladies, you know, it, it really is important because I don't know, if you listen to the news, if you really pay attention, you'll start seeing so many things that are starting to rise up in African-American women. You know, we weren't sick like that back in the day, but now we are, so take heed to taking care of yourself and hey, get in contact with Miss Christie, okay? We'll see you right after this.